Hello, everybody! Welcome to Wednesday's episode of Kingdom Hearts 1.5 Remix. Um, we beat Jafar last time, got our green Trinity piece, and now we are headed off to the next world. So they're talking about the um, the Trinity Marks was in their Trinity Mark in the accessory shop, and then there wasn't their. Uh, also talk about the torn pages, so and we can go back and do the book. However, we're gonna continue. Um, I don't want to delay. Excuse me. Um, I don't want to delay the uh, playthrough. And we're just going to continue on going on to the next world. So, let's continue that. Friday's Hour of Power will be clean up, which means we will be going through um, doing the such things as mentioned. Uh, like going to the, back to the other worlds, doing uh, cleaning up trinities. That kind of stuff, so. Ooh. I'm hoping this puts us in the right area. I apologize if it does. It sounds like we're going the right area. Maybe. Yeah, we went the wrong way. No, Olympus Coliseum, we're not doing you right now. Oh, high score though. I think there's something to do with the relations on the gummy ship stuff though. Where we do have to get the high scores like that and whatnot. So, what have we learned? Not go through the portals. And go through the portal, we're just grabbing the star. I believe Sid has some new gummy stuff for us too. So I think what we'll do, I'll do off screen is um, I won't do any um, story progression. I won't do any cleanup. I will just purely do... Do you know what? Actually, now I think about it, if the, pow the, uh, the hour of power episodes go a little too long, we may do random streams of cleanup, and then we'll just do that as a... Like, uh, uh, is a stream one night? Potentially? No. Uh, no, no guarantees right now. But definitely off screen, we're gonna, um, because that's so boring. The whole gummy ship stuff is extremely boring. I hate putting the, the, even these sections in the episodes. I would like to put them out, but it's all, the, these parts are also good talking points. And I can't believe I hit almost every single one of those things. Um, so I can talk to you guys a little bit about what's, what to expect, what's to come. 
on like future episodes. All right, about to hit the next world. It's Monstro. Wow, it's huge. That's what she said. Excuse me. Make sure that the audio. Okay. Yeah, it's gonna swallow us. Giggity. I don't remember, I know I mentioned it in the last episode, but I said I named my daughter after a video game character. It's, uh, like Robin Williams did. This has no talking in it, so we can talk over this a little bit. Um. I mentioned, I, I mentioned that. I don't know if I actually mentioned the name I gave her. It's Kyrie. I gave her the name Kyrie. Because this game means the world to me. And that's why we're doing the Let's Play first uh, on this channel. I'm just assuming they couldn't find like voice actors for the kids. What are you guys doing? Where are we anyway? Whoa! Oh, you know, I think that big old whale monstro just swallowed us. And for today's weather, expect showers. Oh, heavy showers. Hey! Who's there? It's me! It's just Pinocchio. Pinocchio? Pinocchio? Pinocchio, where are you going? Pinocchio! Come on, everybody, after him, quick! Oh, yeah. This is, uh... I didn't like this world when I first um, played this game. Sorry, I'm checking something real quick. All right. What have you got there, Pinocchio? With this, we can get out of here, Father. Really? With this big block, you think so? It's true. So, I don't know why the mic is how did you up end my up soda. here, Pinocchio? Oh my, so the whale swallowed all of you too? My goodness! Yeah, looks like it. My name is Geppetto. I'm Pinocchio's father. When we got separated, I traveled all over looking for him. Thank goodness we're together again. So, you seem to know Pinocchio quite well. I hope he uh, was a good boy in my absence. Sure. Well, 
we've all had quite a journey. Right, Pinocchio? Pinocchio! So the reason why, and I was going to explain that too, before I got distracted with the thing I was doing on the screen, uh, what you guys couldn't see, uh, is it's kind of a, it was kind of a maze, and I I don't know why it was such a maze. It's one of the easiest uh, levels to... I'm choking on my word, because I just said that. <laughs> it's the easiest thing, and every single time I say that, things don't get so easy, do they? Anyway, um... But it is, it, it was one of the easier mazes to go through in most games that I've played, so I'm seeing if we can't get anything over here. Pretty sure this is where we get high jump as well. Not trying to be spoilery or anything. That's not spoiler, it's just an ability that I believe we get. This will help us with some of our um, cleanup. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'll well, we'll just go. I don't think we can really do anything right now. This is one funky looking whale on the inside. What are you doing? Come on, let's go back. You know, Geppetto's awfully worried about you. Pinocchio, stop fooling around. This is no time for games. But Sora, I thought you liked games. Or are you too cool to play them now that you have the Keyblade? Riku? W what are you doing here? Just playing with Pinocchio. You know what I mean. What about Kyrie? Did you find her? Maybe. Catch us, and maybe I'll tell you what I know. Come on! So, one thing I kind of get disappointed, I'm a little disappointed with this game in. Uh, now I'm looking back on it, and I look at Kingdom Hearts 3, and I can't really be disappointed. Okay. That is. I'm not disappointed. I just wish they would have done more. Um, I mean, it's all in the past, right? So, what they did with Kingdom Hearts 3 is that they allowed you to basically, you could run through the entire game with the same three Keyblades if you wanted to, because they would give you the option of three Keyblades in that game. With this game, they barely give you an ability. Kingdom Hearts 2, they give them abilities, which kind of incentivize you more to go ahead and actually run with particular weapons all the way through. But some weapons were weaker than other, like a lot weaker than the others, and like the Kingdom Key. The Kingdom Key was very notoriously weak. But that's why I really liked that Kingdom Hearts 3, right? So I could run through the entire game with like the Kingdom Key, like the first three weapons you get out of the game. And I thought that was like the coolest thing ever. Technically you can in this game. Is it fun to? Really? I did it once on the PS2. It wasn't that great. I'm almost tempted to go back to the... These only, this thing only gave me one extra strength, and it has a shorter reach than the... Um, the Deep Jungle one. I can't remember the name of it. And this has a chance to deal, but seldom deals critical blows. A powerful weapon that's difficult to deflect. See, and that's kind of vague. So do they mean by like... I never got that. I'm assuming that means it's harder for enemies to reverse my attack. Maybe? 
Leave my favorite key. Leave my favorite key right in my game. And you can use that all the way to the end. It's the, uh, the Lionheart key. The Lionheart key blade is fantastic. Yeah, so when we get to, uh, and that's something else too that I was thinking about, um, between this episode and last wall, yeah, I guess you could say that, between this episode and last episode, is when we get to the final boss, I'm considering doing, killing the final boss, no ultimate weapon, play through it as if we were playing the game. No cleanup, none of that stuff. Then we go through, like, go back through the Lichus Coliseum. Because there's a lot more than just what we've done so far. Like, there's a ton for Olympus Coliseum than what we've done. And once we uh, get to the game, we go back and do the rest of the game. Take out the final boss. Take out the secret boss. He's multiple. Um, yeah, I think we'll do it that way. Yeah. Go the jerk step below. Yeah, it'll be the jerk step below. Be joik. I was gonna duck, I was gonna guard. Typically you can get away with a guard on that. Yeah. And Donald with the clutch, with the clutch, but the fire save. A lot of fighting here.
it back up. I think there may be like a chest if we drop down and go into that room. But again, we'll be clean up later. So, here's something else that uh, I wanted to kind of talk about a little bit, just kind of middle of all the gameplay and whatnot. So, I've been going through a lot of growing up. Well, what do you mean by that? What, what do I mean by that? So, I've started to... Actually, I think I got this a little bit ago. Anyway, so I started to understand what I should do in my life. So, again, what do I mean by that? So, I've always talked to people about, like, what I do on my time off. And I only play video because that's all I did. I didn't work out, I didn't, you know, um, do any other activity. Like, I love video games that much. That's all I did. I work out work. My wife was my wife is okay with that. She's still okay with that. But I wanted to fuel that time into something really more constructive. Hence his YouTube channel. Hence my Twitch channel. Uh, and I've been enjoying it a lot more. And I was making messing around with the with a deck that I was building for Magic. And I was sitting there telling myself. I'm like, oh, I could be working on a YouTube channel, I can do this. That kind of stuff, right? And I'm like, why am I not doing that then? So, and, and, and you know, I there's always time to mess around with that kind of stuff and whatnot, too. But I felt like, for the first time, it just kind of hit me, you know, for the first time today. And it felt good, if that makes any sense. It just seems like a lot of my time now is going into more constructive things. I I'm obtaining a new skill while I'm doing this. Sure, the videos aren't the highest quality right now, but um, they will get there. I, I, I can assure you. Ah, oh, crap. Did you? That's where we want, actually want to go. Not here. That's not where we, This is not where we wanted to go. Crap. Uh -huh. Alright. Not chamber two. Stupid ghosts. So annoying. But anyway, um, I've always wanted to fuel my time into something. Oh, cutscene. Why do you still care about that boy? He has all but deserted you for the Keyblade and his new companions, after all. I don't care about him. I was just messing with him a little. Oh, really? Of course you would. Beware the darkness in your heart. The heartless prey upon it. Mind your own business. Riku! What's the matter with you? What are you thinking? Don't you realize what you're doing? I was about to ask you the same thing, Sora. You only seem interested in running around and showing off that Keyblade these days. Do you even want to save Kairi? I do. Ah! Bum, bum, bum. Uh... Before we go in there, uh, quick talk. I was pretty much over. I, I think I'm just repeating myself at this point. 
just super happy that I'm actually finding my time to find something more constructive to put my gaming into. I've always been told to do it. I just never pulled the trigger. I feel like I needed to take care of myself first before I ended up actually uh, doing this kind of thing. I need to be in the right mindset, you know? Enough of that. Let's kill this asshole. You up for this? No problem. Let's do it. <laughs> Win! Yeah. 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 Come on! Goofy. Yeah, that works. We can throw the ray of light on him. Why not? Lucky strike. Yes. In the American version, in fact, it was called Lucky Lucky. Pinocchio! Pinocchio! Please, give me back my son! Sorry, old man. I have some unfinished business with this puppet. He's no puppet. Pinocchio is my little boy. He is unusual. Not many puppets have hearts. I'm not sure. But maybe he can help someone who's lost theirs. Wait a minute. Are you talking about Kyrie? What do you care about her? We, we care. Yeah, there we go. All right. I was thinking about ending it right here, but we're not at the half hour mark yet. So we press forward. It's right here. Sometimes you'll see me talk about Clea, but not do it right now. But if it's right here, it's right here. We're gonna do that. Actually, we will end it in, in this area. Reason why I say that is because we're gonna get through the um, getting all this treasure and stuff. And then once we're done. It'll be about a half hour. You know what? Screw it. Let's just let's just kill the boss. Bull game. Bull. 
You saw Sora grabbing onto it. Uh, I don't think I can get up there and grab that yet. Anyway, it's fine. Let's just carry on our wayward son. I think we had a call on the day today yet. Um, eh, I can't really think of one. Actually, no. I, I did. I did just think of one. Um, are you guys? What are you guys doing? Um, how do you guys uh, focus or channel your extra energy that you have within the day? Do you? I don't know. Create a YouTube channel yourselves. Let me know. I would be. I would love to check it out. Or do you? Just what do you do? Period. Comment of the day. What do you do with your this extra spare en energy that's you might have right now? Or how do you focus your extra time besides video games? It's right here. Version, they made it a 5 AP um, ability. I'm like, I'm just thinking to myself, that is absurd. Why would you do 5? territory. We're only at 33 minutes. Hey! Let Pinocchio go, Riku! A puppet that's lost its heart to the heartless. Maybe it holds the key to helping Kairi. How about it, Sora? Let's join forces to save her. We can do it together. What? You'd rather fight me? Over a puppet that has no heart? Heart or no heart, at least he still has a conscience. Conscience? You might not hear it, but right now it's loud and clear. And it's telling me you're on the wrong side! Then you leave me no choice. Pinocchio! Pinocchio! Jiminy, I'm not gonna make it. Oh, stop your pooping. <laughs> Oh. Oh. oh, I guess I'm okay. Told you. Come on! 
This MP system is so broken. Ah, uh, nope, that, not what we wanted to do. Not what we wanted to do. I mean, we're already at MP, but look how fast it recovers. I mean, he's also essentially crapping out MP orbs and HP orbs for us. Actually, now I'm thinking about it, I don't really remember any other bosses in any of the Kingdom Hearts series besides the first game that actually did stuff like this, where they gave you certain points of, like, recovery. Oh, no, 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 no. I was... I saw my health, and I was like, I better heal. <sighs> Alright. Let's just get out of here. Crap. I, I needed to be paying more attention to that. It's not a hard boss. It, it's just... You just gotta, you gotta beat that ass. Alright, would you stop? Okay, would you? I would really appreciate it if you could stop that. I swear, this game kills me right here again. I couldn't even grab that big orb right there that was just sitting underneath him. There we go. You're a jerk. Come on. This should help. Wind. This should help. Would you heal already, please, Sora? Jesus. My God. My hell. Got it. Just a little overboard today, but. Riku! Riku, where are you? Obtain the power of time. So, Kyrie's like a lifeless puppet now? Precisely. And her heart was... Taken by the heartless, no doubt. Tell me, what can I do? There are seven maidens of the purest heart. We call them the princesses of heart. Gather them together, and a door will open to the heart of all worlds. Within lies untold wisdom. There you will surely find a way to recover Kyrie's heart. Now, I'll grant you a marvelous gift.
the power to control the heartless. Soon, Kari. Soon. Uh oh. Okay, y'all. We're gonna end it right here. Um, I appreciate you guys watching this video. Uh, if you like what you see, as always, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment on the video. And as always, I'll see you in the next video. Later! <laughs>